you must have observed transparent materials being used in spectacles or telescopes or camera lenses. In this class, we will identify prisms and lenses and will also observe refraction through them. Prism is a transparent material with identical and parallel ends. These are the identical and parallel ends and all the surfaces of a prism are flat. These are the flat surfaces. This is also a prism as it also has identical and parallel surfaces and all the ends are flat. This material also has flat surfaces but you may observe that the ends are not parallel so it will not be considered as a prism. A lens is a transparent material bounded by two surfaces of which at least one surface is spherical. You can see here, here both the surfaces are spherical, here one surface is plane and the other is spherical. In this lens also one surface is plane and the other is spherical. In the case of this lens, both the surfaces are spherical. So what is a convex, convex lens? A convex lens is a lens which is thicker at the middle and thinner at the edges. Concave lens, it is a lens which is thicker at the edges. You can see this is thick at the edge, thicker at the edges and thinner in the middle. So this is a con these two are convex lenses and these two are concave lenses. Now let us observe the refraction through different kinds of lenses. This is a biconvex or simply a convex lens. When parallel rays of light fall on this lens, what happens? They after refraction they meet at a point and this point is called the focus. So a convex lens is called a converging lens and it has a real focus. One surface of this lens is plane and the other surface is convex. So this is a plano convex lens. In case of a plano convex lens, parallel rays of light after refraction meet at a point called the focus of this lens. This is a biconcave lens. When parallel rays of light fall on a biconcave lens, the rays diverse, that is the distance between the rays increases. So the concave lens is also called a diverging lens. These rays will never actually meet, but they appear to come from a point somewhere here and that point is called the focus. So a concave lens does not have a real focus. This lens is a plano concave lens as one surface of this lens is plane and the other surface is concave. Here also the parallel rays of light get diverse and appear to meet at a point and that point is called the virtual focus of this plano concave lens. When parallel rays of light pass through the surface of a prism, they bend towards the base of the prism.